very short video on how to turn on motion blur in Maya and Arnold. <clears throat> so let's say we're going to render out the shot. So I've done a little bit of um, fun animation here. Here's Monty and he's going to exit the shot. He's going to do this kind of mad scramble and then fly out at the end. Now when we when we render this out we don't want to see these legs as distinct legs as it were. We want motion blur on that. So when we do our rendering we're going to want to motion blur it because it's going to look a lot better. So how do we turn on motion blur? Well, we're going to go to render settings. So we go to our render settings under the um, Arnold tab or rather um, you say so we're going to have to do all the usual stuff under um, under the common tab. Uh, we're going to make sure we're going to render with Arnold. We're going to render JPEGs, image quality, whatever name dot hashtag dot ext frame padding four. select the frame range. Make sure we uh, render from our shot camera. Make sure we render some kind of HD. Typically we want HD. I'm rendering HD 540 because it's quite low res. Um, and then to make sure we turn on our motion blur we've got to go to the Arnold renderer tab and go down here to motion blur and make sure that motion blur is enabled. So that's the crucial thing. If you get motion blur enabled then you will get motion blur on your animation. And that's it. That's all you have to do. Then the next thing you're going to do is go to render render sequence and then just keep an eye out for the frames in your images folder in in Maya in your, in your Maya project folder um, and you can see if motion blur has been turned on but that should be all that you need to do